Basically, I feel like I'm the human embodiment of cargo shorts right now, but make it fashion. Oh, all my outfits are about being functional. I hate that for me. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching, Hi, are you trying to do my intro? So this is how I look most of the week. I've got this little guy in my arms that I'm usually chasing after my two-year-old. Is he on the camera? Look at him. Okay. Can you say hi? Oh. So for today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my realistic outfits for the week. Yes. Even though I'm spending a lot more time at home and I'm doing mom things, I still want to feel like myself. I still love fashion, I still love style. I wanted to share the outfits with you guys that I'm wearing in my real life, the pieces that I've found that I personally love, and the brands that I'm loving. So you'll be seeing all of the fun athleisure pieces I have found and wear throughout the week. Be sure to let me know down below in the comments if you guys have a favorite outfit from this video and if you want me to make this a regular series on my channel. Now let's get in to my realistic outfits of the week. I'm obsessed with this jacket. If you live in the Midwest, you know that like March, April, even May is still pretty cold and windy. So I wanted something that I could wear in those in-between months. I absolutely love this military army green for spring. It's still got some black in it, so it's not too far of a deviation from my typical style. And I absolutely love the throwback to the Denali's I used to wear when I was younger with the same kind of black patches and the North Face logo. Got the little drawstrings around the waist to really give you that defined waist still. So I love that I don't look like a green blob in this. And I love that these sleeves are actually long. I'm five foot 11 typically, Clothes are on the shorter side on me. I have very long limbs. I love that it has the black edging on the sleeves. I'm wearing my leggings that have pockets in them. I can slip my phone in the pocket. I can slip my keys in the pocket, same with this coat. Basically, I feel like I'm the human embodiment of cargo shorts right now, but make it fashion. And finally, for my shoes, these are actually Moto Boots by UGG. I get so many requests every time I show these on Instagram. Sadly, I think these sold out in the fall when they came out with them. So I would wear this outfit taking my kids on a walk, going to the farmer's market. I think this is seriously perfect for transitional spring weather. Really shaking things up, back with another comfortable outfit. I'm really excited about today's outfit because I finally found the perfect sweatshirt to match my beige Adidas hat. My friend on Instagram, um, her handle is Brooklyn Blonde. She linked this Adidas hat. I've been searching for the perfect sweatshirt to wear with it. And I finally found this one. This sweatshirt is from Revolve. I'll link it down below. The sweatshirt's super comfortable. I just like that the hat and it match. It makes it feel a little bit more coordinated, a little bit more planned, even though I'm in a sweatshirt. It makes me feel like I'm more put together mom, not mom who didn't get any sleep, even though that last statement is definitely still true. Still wearing this outfit with my leggings with the pockets. Got a pocket in the front, pocket in the side. I'm so lame. It's like the minute you have a child, you become the lamest person on earth. What happened to me? Wearing this outfit with my white APL gym shoes. I bought the same pair of gym shoes in all white. So I've got an all black pair and an all white pair. So comfortable. It feels like I'm walking on a mattress. I can wear these for very long walks with my children. I love that they don't have any laces. I can't say enough good things about these gym shoes. Another thing that just makes me feel like a little bit more elevated is my Apple watch band. My husband bought me this for Christmas. I get a lot of questions about this anytime you guys see a peek of it on Instagram stories. This watch band is from Lagos. So here I am back at you guys with another outfit full of pockets. How exciting. Pre-kids, I would always look at these vests and be like, why does anyone wear a vest? I don't get it. Like you just want this part of you to be warm. Your arms don't get cold. Doesn't make sense to me. And now that I've had kids, I understand that this is really all you need because when you're lugging a toddler on one arm, a car seat in the other, you're trying to push stuff and open doors, you're sweating like crazy. So now I'm the biggest fan of us ever. Oh, all my outfits are about being functional. I hate that for me. This vest is from North Face. It's reversible. It's amazing the things you get excited about when you're a parent. Furry on the inside and 
whatever that material is on the outside. The long sleeve that I'm wearing it with is the Free People Arden shirt. I bought this at the beginning of last fall. I think it's still available. If it is, I'll link it down below. It's super long. It's got thumb holes. It's long enough to cover you in the back and in the front. This is truly the perfect layering piece. I'm wearing my white aloe hat. I have the same hat in all black. It's my go-to. I paired this outfit with my APL gym shoes. They're definitely on the pricier side. These are splurged gym shoes. I love that these are all black. They have no laces. They're very practical. They're still very sleek. They're extremely comfortable. I can wear these all day momming at the park on a long walk. I still feel like they look like a cool gym shoe. I don't feel like I'm sacrificing all of myself to be functional. Side note, I wore this outfit out on a walk with my family and I think I saw three other women in my neighborhood wearing some kind of variation of this look. Great. That means it is the certified mom uniform of this spring apparently. This is a crop sweatshirt. I don't know what it's showing up on camera. It's kind of like a mix of a dark charcoal with like a little bit of a purple tint to it. I don't know. It's longer in the back and it's got this like really cool open back with this like fake sports bra looking cutout in it. Really easy to throw on. Don't mind if I get baby spit up all over me because I definitely have that happen to me all day long. I'm wearing it again with my leggings with the pockets, pockets in the front. I think the name of this video should just be changed to <laughs> realistic pockets of the week. And then I'm wearing it again with my all black APL gym shoes and my black aloe hat. There's not much else to say about this outfit other than I can chase my kids around in this. I can wear it to the park and feel dressed enough, but at least it feels like I still got dressed. You know, it's not like I'm at the park in pajamas. How far my standards have fallen. So for today's outfit, I changed out of my sweatpants into my nice sweatpants. <laughs> Athleisure and matching sweatsuits has always been my vibe, still the case. My sweatsuit today is by Soya and Q, and Soya and Q is one of my all-time favorite outerwear brands. And I was so excited to see that they released a line of sweats now. So this is one of their sweatsuits. And seriously, this is probably the nicest coordinating set that I own. It is so luxurious, so comfortable. It feels very high-end wearing it. It honestly does feel like my nice pair of sweatpants. I'm wearing this set with my Golden Gear sneakers. I love that these shoes have just a little bit of a lift built into the shoe. I also love that Golden Goose make your foot look smaller. I don't know what kind of sorcery is happening with this shoe, but when I put these next to my typical gym shoe, they definitely make my feet look smaller. Whenever I go to an airport again or I get on a flight again, this is the outfit I'll be wearing. All right, guys, those are my realistic outfits of the week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please let me know by giving the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and let me know down below in the comments what your favorite outfit was. If you guys like any of the pieces I show in today's video, I will have them all down below in the description for you guys if they're still available. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.